Well, the final day of the city golf tournament this afternoon, both the men and women separated by only a few strokes. With the rain last night, the greens played somewhat slower today, but still fast enough to keep you guessing. On the men's side of things, Ryan Swanky played lights out yesterday, firing a six under 65. Zach Burry, though, nipping at his heels. And on the women's ledger, it looked to be a battle between Lucy Clark and Dakota Limpkeman. We'd start with the men, however. Beautiful day out there, starting things off in this one. And this is Mr. Ryan Swanky on the power. Five fifth. How about the chip from him? He's going to put this one above the hole and just let gravity take its course as that one just pulls back towards the hole, puts it with about a few feet from the cup, but then it'd be Zach Burry time. He's going to fire that one home right there for the birdie. Now remember Zach yesterday, he eagled that hole, that par five, very, very gettable from two, and that's exactly what Zach did yesterday, but you know, he gets the birdie there today and just keeps playing those par fives very well. Let's move on over to the women's side of things. How about Dakota Limpkeman today. The approach right here on the 12th. Look at that. She puts that one within a few feet of the cup. She was on her game out there today. Here's Lucy Clark as well. She was the leader after yesterday. Nice putt, uphill putt, I should say, from her. Puts that one just by the hole. And then here's Dakota's birdie putt downhill. Very tricky. She spent a lot of time looking at that one, and uh, it worked out because she nailed that. If she, put, she misses the hole, that thing probably goes 10 feet past that. She gets that one to go for the birdie. Here's Drew Eaton right here looking for his birdie as well, but he's going to blow that one by the hole steps right up with the super stroke putter right there and he's gonna tap that one in for the par drew having a nice week out there had a 75 yesterday and gets that one to go here's colby rodmick tap and birdie right here nice putt from him he had a nice week as well the former blue devil gonna be shifting our attention back to zach burry right here on the par five six how about this putt this is for eagle Puts that one just inches to the left right there. He would later tap in for birdie right there, but it just wouldn't be enough today because this guy, he had such a big day yesterday and just played masterfully again today. Finished one under Mr. Ryan Swinky. That's a tap in birdie right there as the rain just started to come. They picked this up after, and then we're going to see Zach step up and put it in right here. But as we take you to the results, we are going to tell you that Mr. Ryan Swinky is your men's champion after he hits it. And how about that? He finishes 7 under for the week. Zach Burry, 6 under for the week. Adam Pfeiffer finishes at even. Dakota Limpkeman gets it done for the women as we take it to the women's side of things. She finishes plus 5 for the week. Such a great day out there today. Lucy Clark finishes in 2nd. Lindsey Burry had a big day as well. She finishes in 3rd. Definitely going to be catching up with Miss Limpkeman in the next couple of weeks before she heads off to Linenwood.